Hi, good morning. Our generation advent calendar, which isn't for an our generation doll, is to see whether the items are compatible for our smart doll. And up to now, it has been amazing. She is sporting the glasses at the moment that she got in one of the last ones. They are too big, really, but they look a bit of fun. Perhaps they're sort of like a pair of, I don't know, um, going out party, messing about sort of tight glasses. Uh, but they are quite cute. I do like them. They are well structured and everything. And it's weird, the glass actually almost magnifies as well in the eyes. So that is quite fun. So uh, Bree's going to go to the back of the room so we can look at the calendar. So we're going to move her over. She's actually got her Lilo and Stitch slippers on today. So she's keeping her feet nice and warm. So we'll pop her up here. Oh, there you go. I nearly fell off the chair then. And let's have a look what we've got. So holding it up where is oh look we've got one coming open there i'm really bad aren't i the way i've done this i'm just so disorganized right 21 21 is down here if i can get my nail in yep oh this is cute not so sure whether it's for the doll would be good for some scene setting i suppose or oh, just as a decoration it's a little bit of fun so if i can get him out Ta -da! we have a little father christmas he looks more like in a gnome form that makes sense. He's crossing his hands at the back, which is quite cute. Her, his bushy eyebrows are way over his eyes, so you can't see his eyes. Um, it's like a hollow plastic, I think. I mean, it just makes a great Christmas decoration, doesn't it? It's just a little bit of fun. But also, you could use it with your dolls if you've got a scene to set, because it would fit for this size dolls. So he is sort of cute, isn't he? So we're going to pop him down, and we're going to have a look at... Da -da 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 -da. 22 oh this is a nice one i'm actually going to put the box down because i want to get this one out properly so i'm putting the box down now this will work nicely for our smart doll um although brie's been eating absolutely everything up to now oh, this is so nice can you see it basically um i would say it's a cherry pie something like that i want it's not apple or anything no it's actually in another packet which i want to get out because it's it does something interesting well not something that interesting but ah my scissors are under here somewhere i have a pair of scissors here here we go because i'm not getting into that at all this is actually really heavy as well so we have oh there we go so it comes in parts we have the dish we have the actual uh, pie or flan whatever you want to call it and look we have a little piece that comes out how cute is that so if you're wanting to show your doll actually eating something, she could be holding this one, which I will do some photos of her with it. But if you look inside, can you see inside? You can see all, it's definitely cherry, isn't it? That's a cherry pie, because you can see all the little round bits. The detail in that is really quite amazing. Fits nicely in there. So obviously the doll can hold it, or it could go on a little table. Or as I say, you could have her eating a piece of it. So yeah, I would class that as a smart doll tick. I think we've done pretty well. And um, our little Father Christmas here, half a tick, shall we give him? Um, but yeah, they've been absolutely wonderful. We haven't got long to go. We have just two more, which I am likely to do together because as I mentioned in my previous one, I am running backwards at the moment. It's getting there and I'm loving it all. I love Christmas, but there's still quite a lot of work to do. So. I'm going to pop these down. I'll take some photos of Brie with them, which I think will be quite cute. And I will see you possibly with the final Our Generation Advent Calendar. So I'll see you very soon.